Hey, Lenny. Yeah? G guess what? What? There's a couple of things I, for I forgot again. <laughs> you don't say. Yeah, crazy, right? Uh, and I'm totally not trying to postpone the next level. I'm actually going to show you things that I just completely forgot about. Um, and I don't know. I just realized when I was, put when I was putting stuff in the museum. Mm. Um, first of all, the door in 4-1. Oh, we never got the door? Which was on screen, but we just ignored. Huh. Yep. I feel like it happens a lot. Or at least a couple of times it happens. Or it's like, it's there, but we just forget about it. Mm -hmm. And it's here. I already put them down and put them in a the museum, but... I can at least show the things that are behind them. Like here. <gasps> oh, the... nice. Good old-fashioned... I'm going to assume this is called cell phone in the American version. Oh, yeah, maybe. Most likely. And then the second one, uh, door in 4-2. I guess we just didn't like doors, mm. This that recording session. <laughs> also, since this video will probably only be that, that the level that, that shall not be named, um, there's actually a couple of things to say about that level, and not just like, holy fuck, I hate it. Um, it's what more interesting you than you would think. talking about? Well, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and most people also know what I'm talking oh, about. But... People were ready for, oh, can't wait for that level. Yeah, uh, you, you'll be surprised, I think. <laughs> seeing the amount of things I have to or want to talk about, about that level. Um, but yeah, um, if it feels like my mind's a little bit all over the place, that's because I got one of the biggest... I don't want to call it scares. There's the biggest out of nowhere what the fucks um, in a long time for me, just just a couple of, a couple hours ago. Uh, out of nowhere, JD Acer just sends us a, a, oh, yeah. a, a <laughs> video in our group chat and just like, okay, what is that? And basically, uh, long game story of the year short, just got yeah, announced. game of the year got announced. Uh, Dog Fun Kingdom is coming to the Switch with, with online. online. I cannot des describe how excited I am for that. I think I might be... No, I was going to say more excited than I was for Advance Wars. That would be very hard to beat. <laughs> Let's just say it's it's a very similar kind of excited. Let's hope this game does not get uh, cancelled out of nowhere mm. or postponed until further notice. Yeah, I mean, the thing is like... The thing like, oh, Game of the Year gonna announce... It's not even an exaggeration. No, it's like the the memories that we have of that game, like that Lenny I sh and I shared, and a couple of friends. It's just like one, like the one of the most fond of memories yeah, like when I we, have. When we played game. that game, I don't remember what year it was exactly, but that was the thing was 2014. But that was my favorite game that I played that year by yes. far. It was awesome. Dokapon is so phenomenal. And this announcement is so out of nowhere, it would basically be the same thing as suddenly like, oh, there's a new Paper Mario, like a, yeah. a Paper Mario remake, mm -hmm. like a 64 remake. It's basically the same thing. Yeah, but like, the same man, like, like, what the fuck? Yeah, because like, I remember that um, a few weeks ago, there was an article that was like, oh, um, like a game called Dokopan Connect was raided in Germany Ow. or something. But yeah, it's, uh, it's just a Lenny, title. The, there's a hidden loading zone here. Did you yeah. do you see it? Yeah. You see the little yellow part? Yeah. Great. <laughs> but it was like, who like, we didn't know what it was. Just like it's just the title. So people think like, oh well, well there is a Dokpon game on the Switch. It's just released in Japan, of course. So maybe it's just that one that they're bringing over. Yeah. Which would have been unfortunate because it's not like, <laughs> it's not the Dokpon game. It's not the Dokpon game. Yeah, no. but, but now it's like, oh, thank God, it is the bo the, the Dokapon game. Yeah. Like, I feel like the the audience for this game is rather niche. Like, the game didn't sell all that well. It got a following after the fact. Mm -hmm. Well, that's the thing. I think, like, the amount of people that are into this, it is very niche. Yeah. But the people that are excited are, like, extremely excited. Yeah. <laughs> it happens. There's no in-between. Like, this is the type of game where it gets announced in a direct, and I'm like, I don't care about this. And then, like, one or two people will be like, no, that game is the best. Yeah. And I'm I'm that guy <laughs> this time. And, yes, I'm extremely excited. Uh, we will play it. 
Uh, I don't know in, in what way or how or what frequency, but I, ju I just want to play it. Dude, we're going to fucking... Another thing dude. we've mentioned before mm -hmm. that we want to play it. And it was just like, it, it would be so hard to set up like a, a connection thing on an mm -hmm. emulator and blah, 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 and have it work well. Mm -hmm. Well, now we have an official way with hopefully pretty good online. Let's hope. Like, ah, that's the one thing, like, please let the online be, be okay. It can't be that bad, right? I mean, I can't imagine that it would be a big problem. Like, you don't need to have, like... A crazy, like, um, good connection because there's no, like, timing or anything. It's just like, it just no. needs to register when someone presses a button. So, another, another quick thing, Lenny, before you can continue. Uh, so, yeah. 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 There's a secret here. Yeah, these are very obscure. Why? Why is this jungle so filled with extremely obscure secrets? I feel like maybe. They just had, like, a few things left that they needed to hide somewhere. Like, fuck, where do we put it? They're like, nah, just somewhere th in the just jungle. Just throw them in the jungle somewhere behind some bushes. That, that's fine. All right, Lenny, you can continue if you want to. Well, I mean, just the fact that, yeah, like, I don't think you need crazy online, like, connections in order to play this online. Because it's literally just... If... It just needs to register when oh, yeah. someone presses just a button to select something in a menu. There's no yeah, like actual true. crazy like controls or. I mean, and like, it doesn't really reactions. matter if there's a little bit of lag. Yeah, like lag's button okay. lag, let's say, because who cares? It's just menus. Yeah, exactly. So there's no quick time events in there. Yeah, so it's like it should be completely fine. It's gonna be awesome. And I'm just also excited for like the high quality. Uh, renders of the art because I always liked oh. some of the character <laughs> designs in the game. And, like I think they showed the fe female alchemist, maybe like the pink one. I'm like, ah, <laughs> oh, I, I really like that design. <laughs> just ah, oh, goddamn it! I just want to show a quick thing, and then we can actually do the level uh, we really want to do because this, it's a really oh, it's good level. That's awesome. Like you thought the Enig Mansion was good? Just wait. Yeah, World Five is awesome. I didn't really have to walk back here to, to show my points, but you were talking and, you know, we were saying things. <laughs> and, I mean, it, it was quite romantic, if you ask me, and I didn't want to interrupt you. So. Well, yeah, it would be extremely rude. Yeah, I know. I know, I know. So, yeah, uh, this screen. I'm going to make a bold statement. And I'll probably have to eat my words. But I've seen multiple sources and multiple comments say you can get the bridge piece without removing all the trash. If you keep looking, yeah. at some point, you'll get it. I don't believe that for a second. I have found no actual video proof. So here I am with the challenge. If you have video proof, send it to me on Discord, and I'll give you like a $20 eShop card. <gasps> Ooh. Because I don't believe it. There, there's <laughs> no way. So I want to be proven wrong on this because like, it sounds like a thing this game would do. Just be like, haha, if you search for for like three hours, you can find it. The challenge is set. So the challenge is set. Uh, get ready for your $20 eShop card. Um, we'll see. Maybe I'll get quirky and give you a $50 eShop card. But uh, for, for now, <laughs> I'm going to say 20. We'll see. Uh, <laughs> or it'll just yeah, be 15. So there's a challenge, guys. Or, or like one. <laughs> no, no. Like, I, I promised the 20, so you'll get the 20 now at least. Yeah, there's a challenge, guys. Prove me wrong, please, because that would be so funny if if, <laughs> if it's a thing. Like it even says so on Mario Wiki, so I'm, I was so confused. Um, well, the thing yeah, is, like, anyway. how long do you have to do it? I have no idea. So, yeah, five. Speaking of long, dash three. Maybe this level needs a bit of an introduction. And I wish Lenny was actually here to <laughs> act as my um, help me. Um, Back as my control group again. Oh, yeah. Because I would really like him to play this level and show me why it's so bad. Because I'm going to tell you, I'm going to play this and I won't have any issues. And that's the thing. If you know what to do, there's nothing wrong with this level. The issue is what you quote unquote <laughs> need to do is so dumb and unintuitive most players would just run into issues and keep dying. Mm -hmm. Like, you, you definitely remember this level, right, Lenny? Uh, yes, I do. And frustration? That, maybe? Maybe. That's weird, because you, you do remember it. 
Oh, I remember this level thinking that it's stupid. Oh, okay. And it also reminds me of a level in Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, but you also haven't played that. But I'll get into it. Uh, but yeah, let's first start this level. And... I'm just, yeah, I'll just, I'll just do my thing. So we're still on the water. Oh, you're right. oh my <gasps> oh god, no. it's a big fish. Big fish. I'm just gonna hang out over here. Yep, you, you do that. Nom nom nom. Oh. So this first charge will always be a charge forward. Mm -hmm. So this is one, you just, yeah, you yeah, go, just to gotta go to the side. All right. And after that, he'll, he'll go where you are. Yeah, because like, look around. And he has a oh, couple, he has a couple of move. attacks. He has a dash that he did. He has a jump. Oh, that's weird. He totally didn't hit me. Yeah, well, that's odd. And the thing there is, if he jumps, it's impossible for him to hit you this far. If he charges, that's another thing. Like he can charge, and then, boom, he'll hit my raft. But I have four, I have four more lives, yeah. so that's fine. If you end up where he charges, it's an instant game over because he eats you. Yeah, if he eats you, it's it's one one and done. Yes. Yeah. Um, do you like my strategy? Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, is he gonna jump and he? Oh, is he gonna charge? Oh, no, no that's a jump. jump. And he can't hit me. That's very weird. Because I'm all the way on the side. Yeah, that's the thing. If you know, well, this level is literally okay. Stick to the left or right, and you're good. Yeah, I'm done. Yeah. But we're not done with this level. Trust me. Because this is something you might not know, and I'm going to show you all of it. But did you know this fish actually has multiple difficulties that are completely hidden from you, but are a thing? The first time through, he's on easy. The second time, I actually don't know. But if you've collected all common pieces in this level, he's actually on a way harder mode than he was right there. Uh, actually, I actually want to go forward. What the fuck? Okay, then, sure. No, go this way. We'll take the long road home. It's really foggy in here, too. Mm -hmm. Ominous. Ooh. Very. Or should I ask you what to do? Or do you, do you, do you know what to do? <gasps> oh, yeah, because it's like a little loop. Yay, that was a nice little loop. I'll actually go forward this time. Mm -hmm. Unless the game really pushes me there, but no. Whee! Yeah, wait, so didn't our raft get destroyed last level as well? Uh, How did we get a new raft? Hmm. It magically spawned underneath us. <laughs> I'll say I jumped behind here and there's a... A big shiny yeah. infinite jump. Um, funny thing about the big shiny infinite jump, uh, and guess what? There's also a mega flash infinite jump, which respectively, I mean, as you know, regular infinite jump does one damage per hit 100 mm -hmm. times. Big shiny infinite jump does two damage 100 times. Uh, mega flash infinite jump does three damage 100 times. The only time you would use those stickers is on bosses that quarter your damage, at which point they'll all do one anyway. Yeah. <laughs> So the Mega Flash and ooh, oh, that's a fancy one. So the big shiny Infinity Jump and Mega Flash Infinity Jump are complete garbage and useless because if you use them on, on regular enemies, regular enemies, they're also useless and complete overkill. So they're dumb stickers. Anyway, hey, can I not sleep on this? Really? Okay then. Oh come on. Uh, also, I'm pretty sure I was gonna call it the luxurious bed because I'm pretty sure that's what it's called in the American version. <laughs> Mm. But no, the four posts are bad because it has four posts. Unlike this challenge, which is like 2,000 plus posts. <laughs> Wait, fucking many, if you ask me. Wait, I can't quit anymore because I'm no longer ahead. I should have quit after Book of Mario 64. Yeah, I mean, that's when I was ahead. Now I'm kind of stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Nowhere to go but down. No, no. Oh. No, that's not true. Now we can go up. 
Oh, great! What? But, but then how do we continue? Yeah, that's really fun, right? So mm -hmm. you did that level and you might have gotten frustrated getting eaten by the fish a couple of yeah, times. Guess what? Uh, if you don't find the secret in here, you have to keep doing it. Mm -hmm. And boy, it's so fun. I love yeah, this fish. Fun. Ooh. Uh, yeah, I'm actually going to check if, if he is now on a harder difficulty. I'm going to try the same thing. I think he might be. We'll see. No? No, apparently not. Like, the way he is now, he is wasting a lot of time. And he basically has to hit you almost every time to even come close mm -hmm. to killing you. And I could have just walked along the side, you know. Then I wouldn't have, wouldn't have had fish trouble. Wouldn't it be nice? Yeah, like, why can't... Whoa, what was that? What? That, okay, <laughs> that was a bit weird. That, that was some weird lag. Was, was it because like I was some, hitting the side? There was some hit stop that I thought, like, wait, is he gonna eat you suddenly? Yeah, there is that stun. It's because I'm hammering. Oh, hold up. Yeah, the fact that I'm getting hit more is just because I'm unlucky and he's charging more over here. Mm -hmm. But if you do this in, well, the easy mode, you, you'll 100% win. There's no chance he'll actually destroy your raft. And he can't eat you when you're this close to the side. The only thing he can do is knock, knock out some logs. So at this point, it's just a boring auto-scroller, which is really dumb. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and super funny because, you know, it's like, oh, we and then he flies away. Isn't that cute? But yeah, it reminds me of Luigi's Mansion, uh, Dark Moon as well. Uh, do you know the boss of the ice level in nope. Luigi's Mansion? You don't? Not at all? Nope. People know what I'm talking about. It's weird because it's not a 3DS game where the whole thing is it's so obnoxious and you'll lose as a new player. But once you know what to do, it's like a cinch. Mm -hmm. It's super dumb. Yeah, the ice boss, he sucks. People hate it. It's 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 exactly like this fish. It's just like, yeah. So yeah, tell me what to do, Lenny. Although it's kind of obvious because we can't really do that much now, can we? Oh boy, what is that place over there? didn't tell me, but I'll still do it. <laughs> I'll take it. But I have to take the ride anyway, because you didn't tell me at all, and I have to do the entire loop again. Oh, no. Thank you, Lenny. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Ah! Why is Raft so resilient to very specific debris? But then not charging fishes. Yes, hello, I want to go here. Red butterfly. butterfly! Oh my god, did you see it? Yep. It's also here. Morpho! Get him! Nah, it doesn't have yellow in its wings. I think we're fine. I'll go into the door. Nom! Oh, wow. Ooh. I'm pretty sure like there's a secret over here as well. Oh yeah, you, you're you're definitely correct. Uh, I like, remember. Yeah, good job because it's so dumb and it's like a, a quote unquote important sticker. Like, there's no tell. I mean, I guess there's a little bit of light. Yeah, filling there's here. a bit of light there. But like, honestly, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I probably looked this one up. Yeah, wow, surprise! Look at that. It's a flashy, the mega. Sorry, the mega flash infinite jump. Uh, it's dumb. Anyway, let's end the end, end, end level, I guess. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure the reason... And I'll actually show you, and you'll immediately be able to tell the fish is just so much harder after completing the level fully. And I think the reason they did that is just to make collecting more Mega Flash or, like, big shiny infinite jumps harder? Oh, I think it's definitely, like... Like, they definitely made sure to put them in this level specifically. Mm-hmm. But they must have known it was frustrating, right? Oh, well, yeah, that's the thing. They, You can get infinite amounts of those stickers, but you have to go through a really shitty, annoying level. So, you know, it's got to be worth it. Yeah, but just now he will never stall and yep. always charge exactly where I am, which will be just enough for him to destroy my raft every time. Mm -hmm. So when you're in on, quote-unquote, hard mode, 
you are forced to actually play the game. Which is super weird, because at one point... You'll, you'll actually know this. Hold up. So, he's still charging me. Oh, he didn't hit me. Huh? So now you would think it's impossible for him to hit, to hit me, right? Because he charges in the same place every time. But for some reason, sometimes he can hit you. And now we're even slimmer, so there should be even lower of a chance. I don't know what actually makes him hit you. Just, it seems extremely arbitrary. Like, how yeah. is that a hit? Again, now it's just like... You know, he went to the left, but he went, like, a little more to the left than last time. So then he hit you. See, now he was so far away, so it shouldn't be possible for him to hit me anymore, right? Like, that's not a hit. Oh, it wasn't. I swear to God if I beat this. <laughs> I think it might be depending on the side of the screen. Honestly, that's what I was thinking. Like, what else could it be? But yeah, that that's what happens. All right. Now let's try to play the level, you know, reacting to what he does. And we all know here the fact is amazing reaction time, so this should be no problem. Yeah, I mean, it's so easy, right? So we know the first one is always a charge forward. Yep. So we can just be on the side. And then we know he's going to charge us again, right? Yep. And he'll charge over here because we're here. Mm -hmm. All right. So. All right, he's there. I'll start moving. Yep. Oh yeah, we're good. He might still hit us. See, that oh. was way more of a hit than any of those other times. Yeah. Alright. Oh, he's in the back. Okay, I'll start moving. Oh wait, he's suddenly charging there. Okay, that's weird. Fine. Okay, we can move, I guess. Because he's oh, gonna yeah. come over he's here. Gonna come. Okay, that was definitely a hit. Come now. Okay, now I'm getting upset that I'm winning. <laughs> Oh no, uh, I started moving too early. Oh, that's fine. Oh no! That was really close. The thing is, yeah, if he eats you, it's, it's game over. Man, he's giving me... Oh yeah, that's... Oh, he didn't have his mouth open. Lucky me. Oh wait, does he sometimes have his mouth open and sometimes he doesn't? I'm pretty sure he does. Yeah, this is... No! And that's a game over. See, yep. what could I have done there? <laughs> like, actually tell me, what could I have done yeah, there? Yeah, no, because you were moving to the left. So when you see us, it, like, oh, gotta move to the right. But yeah, then th you move the thing, so raft, slow. Yeah. That's the problem with the raft. Like, you can't react to what he does because the raft only starts moving after, like, a couple of seconds. Yeah, it, it, it's just very slow before it moves the other direction. Yeah. So what you, I mean, the only tip I can give you to beat this variant of the fish is basically, well, I'll show you and hopefully it'll work. But it's still kind of a trap, dude. Right, so you went down and then immediately start moving. Mm -hmm. So the raft is at full speed once he pops up. And then most likely you'll dodge. Yeah, because that's the thing, I think. And he goes back and. Yeah, the thing you have to oh, do is just, he thing, when he pops up, moving. you just have to be moving. Yeah, and you need to be moving at full speed. Because otherwise, you're not going to be fast enough to dodge. Like, I don't even know what, like, that means. It feels like it means something, but probably not, right? Yeah, I don't know. Like, it's... Oh, no, 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 no. It seemed like oh. a random thing. It was like yeah. a random cute, like, tee -hee. The thing is, if he does a fast charge, that's, like, almost impossible to mm. to dodge and then if he eats you yeah well fuck you yeah you know, i feel like right now i can basically stick by the side and do the same thing again because i mean enough time has passed there's no way you can destroy the rest of my raft mm. that's basically what you do mm -hmm. dodge the first couple of times and then stick to the side this is, you'll probably have enough time probably <laughs> well we'll see finish the level if he jumps now then oh no there's <laughs> no way he'll jump right now if you're sticking to the side he'll always fast charge but only in hard mode yeah we're totally here because that's like part of the ruins please help 
He's gonna do oh one God. more. Oh no! 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 I think we're here. There's pillars. Please! Stop! Stop! Yes! Okay! Oh. <laughs> so yeah, those are my tips. I'm telling you, it's not as bad if you know what to do. That said, I hate this level. It's a really bad level. <laughs> mm. But you yeah, just have to suck it up and do it. All right, everyone. All right. Are we friends? We're friends. Mm -hmm. I mean, you technically only have you. Well, you technically never have to do it uh, more than like the two two times to beat the level. In which case, like that's the easy variant, so that's fine. Um, the only reason you would have to do it again is, I guess, to get the bed again if you miss the door, because you can also just buy it in Decalberg after mm -hmm. getting it once. Yeah. Or if for some reason you want more uh, Mega Flash or Big Shiny Infinite Jumps. And, I mean, as much as I hate it all, I'm going to show you a niche use of them. It's completely unnecessary, of course, because, like, honestly, everything in this game is unnecessary. Uh, but I'll still show you a cool niche use. But if you just like want to finish the museum get it once put it in a museum forget about it don't do this level again it's dumb all right that was my thesis on what's this level even called 5-3 big fish booty in my basement <laughs> oh no mm. i love it look at those two big shoes hey lenny what i've got some big shoes to fill <gasps> Oh. That was a very, very obscure reference. Yeah, because you know I don't think I... Okay, mm. good. No, that's fine. You, 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 there's no need for you to know. I want one guy in the comments to be like, Oh my god! <laughs> Just that one guy, you know? No, I, I, I like it that we're so much on the same wavelength, like 90% of the time. And then sometimes there's something I'm like, Wait, what? Like when he went like a poison a snake. I'm like what? A poison a snake. Like yeah. what the fuck is he talking about? King's Quest. Well, yeah. Now I know. Yeah. Because you told me about it. Yeah. So I I have been filling out the museum off screen by the way. And yes, we will read everything. We've set this m at multiple points. Just not now. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be another dramatic reading episode. Yep. And at that. In that video, I'll probably uh, get my Google spreadsheet open and talk about some damage values. Oh that, boy, that'll be that'll be such interesting content, Lenny. Mm. Oh boy, the reading episode. Yes, a million views.